So finally I had the time to spare a few minutes and do uh, an English tutorial how to set up portal <clears throat> for use with my tweets integration mod. So let's get right to it. The first thing you need to do is to connect a portal to your Twitch account, which I already done. But what you need to do is come here to the settings wheel, select switch, press connect, it will open a window where with it will give you an access token that you will paste here on the box below. After you have pasted the access token, you will need to press the request button to get the chat token, which you will also copy pasted here. After doing so, all you need to do is press save and then start working on what you want to do with portal. Basically, you can either do a button for each an individual action you want it to do, or you can have it all on one button. It's up to you. Since this is the free version, you only have access to like one, two, three, four, yeah, eight buttons. So it's a bit limited, but it still works anyway. So after that, what you need to do is go to your Twitch, your Twitch account, um, basically to your um, dashboard. Then go to community. Uh, let's go to. Pa, 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 uh, you need to go to yeah, view rewards. Then you go to channel points and manage rewards and challenges. Okay. I already have everything set up. So I'm going to use the first reward, which is numpad one, as an example. So basically, what I've done here is simply give it a name. This name is important, so just copy it, copy the name. Uh, then the description, so that people know what the heck they're buying. Then you set up the cost, and this is my advice. Set up a cooldown for every reward redeemable with points that activates anything, that triggers anything with the mod, or you will be spammed. So, I have one... One minute cooldown. It's on. It's only five zombies anyway. So uh, it's up to you. The the, the let's say the the, the cooldown. How high you want to get it? How high? How how high you want to put it? Sorry for my English, but I'm a bit slow today. So after doing so, you have keep in mind that this is the most important bit. It's the the name. This is what uh, portal will use to trigger the event. After setting up the, re the, the reward the way you want it, with the icon you want it, all that kind of thing, just press save. Then you go to touch portal and you just click anywhere. Let's say here. Then you need to go to on event, which means every time an event happens, occurs, whatever you want to say, it will trigger. Uh, an action. So, in this case, you want to go to the left side on the actions and find where Twitch is. After that, you go to event and let's say we're working with the points on channel points redeemed. And this is where that name is important because that's the way that Portal will know when to trigger. So every time somebody buys this event, Portal will trigger whatever it's inside the, the green box, which is the event. So after saying, so when somebody buys this reward, then you need to send a virtual key press. Everything is on the left side, this time under input, a virtual key press, and since it's the first reward, it's numpad one, I think. If it's not, uh, whatever. You, it's just to give you an idea. So let's say numpad one. Then you press add, and anything that's inside the green box will trigger every time this is bought. Which means, and I'll give you an example in a few minutes, a few seconds. So, another important thing, don't forget to 
give the button a name or it will not save. So let's say zombies times five, then save, and that's it. Every time somebody spends points on the reward called zombies, this one, it will trigger a key press, which the mod will recognize and make it happen. Also, there's no need to create several buttons for uh, different actions. You can just put everything in, in one button if you want to. So let's say I also want to activate, uh, to send five zombies when somebody donates like bits. Let's say from, so I just need to click on this event and then I say from one bit to like three bits, give it a margin or just give it a fixed value, it's up to you. So let's say from one to three, uh, it will trigger also NumPy1. So every time somebody buys this reward with channel points or donates between one and three bits, this will happen. Okay? It's that simple. It's very, very... It, it, it looks harder to do than it actually is. So I'm going to show you my config now. So to give you an example of some things you can do. So I have all the events here. I have for uh, this is times five, but whatever. And everything has different names, so I can recognize it. So let's say zombies times three. Yeah, this is the first reward. It's actually numpad zero. Zero. So every time somebody buys this with points, this happens. Every time somebody sends three bits, this happens. Okay. Also, what I have is every time somebody subs to my channel, and you can also do this between, among other things, as long as Portal recognizes the event, you can make it trigger anything in the mod. So, what I have here is anytime everybody subs, resubs, gifts a sub, uh, tier 1, tier 2, tier 3, doesn't matter, it will do numpad 4, 4, and 5. So, if I'm not mistaken, numpad 4 is, uh, in my case, 20 zombies or 25 zombies? Let me check. This is numpad 3. So, it's 25 zombies, numpad 4. Yeah. So, basically, what I have here is, every time somebody subs to my channel, no matter what kind of sub it is, it will send a jet which is numpad number 5 for me, uh, and uh, 50 zombies, basically. So you can do it, uh, let's say, there's no limit for what you can do, basically. So this is how I have it, this is how I have it to work, uh, this is my personal settings, it doesn't mean you have to do it like I did, you can do whatever you want. So basically, this is it. After this, everything should work, but keep in mind, if you're tapped out of the game, it will not uh, trigger the event, because it sends a key press, and the key press uh, is sent directly to the app that is focused on the moment. So, if somebody sends you, like, uh, five zombies, which is numpad zero, and uh, you're not in-game, it will send that key press to the app it's currently focused by Windows. Okay, so that's about it. Sorry for the delay, but ah, it's been weird and chaotic lately. Thank you very much for using my mod. See you around.